Ready? He's an old, no need if you go to pick up stylish. Glock talk, big t shirt, Billy. Got on my wrist, but I want that diamond. Talk crazy when I pull up his side. How high? What's up, bro? I don't even know what they're doing right now. I'm just ready to get on the freaking boat. As you know, yesterday was. I was tired. It was a tiring day for Kevin. And, um. We're supposed to be leaving right now. Or whatnot. We're about to leave the hotel. And I can barely see. I have my ND, ND filter on. But, we're about to leave the hotel. Um. Just to get on the boat. I think it's like early check in, I think. I'm not sure. I think. I think it is early check in. Hopefully, the lighting's good. But, um. I think it is early check in. Um. But, yeah. I can't wait, man. I can't believe it. Like, the day has finally come that we're getting on the boat. And this is day one. Oh my god, oh my god. I'm so bro, I'm so freaking hyped, man. Listen. <sighs> Finally, like after three freaking years, we're finally on the cruise. We're on Carnival Mardi Gras. Like literally, the mo like the, the, the ship is huge. I was lost. I was lost. I was lost in the sun, y'all. I don't even know where I was going, man. I, I really didn't. Finally, we're freaking here. Um, I'm gonna give a whole room tour. Uh, so yeah. Um, uh, but yeah. But um, I guess uh, you know. Right now I'm in the stateroom. Um, I'm gonna give you all a stateroom tour of the Carnival Mardi Gras. Um, the stateroom that we're in. Um, the stateroom is seven seventeen two six eight or whatnot. There's a stateroom number. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do it. So. As you know, yes, this is the boring part, um, somewhat. Uh, that's like on the back. Uh, God forbid that anybody, anything happens on anybody's ship who's watching this video. But you always go in the back of the door in case y'all need help with any type of getting to a certain deck from Muster Station, Life Jacket, etc. Et but to the part, um, now, so these are the closets, of course, you know, nice little roomy, roomy closets where you can just. Set all your this stuff, store all your stuff. Uh, sometimes I usually keep my stuff in my pa in my uh, suitcase, and sometimes I bring it up. It just depends. You get a second one, so both for uh, both people, I guess. Um, another one, uh, this you can store anything in the safe. Um, of course, there is a safe in here. 
like cell phones or anything like that unless you're trying to get on social media on Wi-Fi or text anybody, which I do not recommend uh, somewhat. So if it's like something important where you have to test that person, then yes. But honestly, don't do social media on the boat. Like literally just enjoy, enjoy, enjoy vacation. Like be disconnected from the outside world. I mean, if you have to do like schoolwork and stuff like that, that's fine. But try to get that work done before you even hop on the cruise, you know, anything done. Um, and try to just disconnect, disconnect from back from home and just enjoy your time enjoy you enjoy and have just have fun like don't even worry about work but back to this um as you know this is a beach towel um this is another thing i do not heavily do not recommend do not touch the towel just leave it there it is 22 dollars per towel just bring your towel from home that's it that's all you gotta do is bring your towel from home um, that's it for that. Do not, I'm telling y'all, just bring a towel from home. This is the luggage mat. Yes, the infamous luggage mat. I'm not going to say what, what happened back in 2018 with the luggage mat because I don't want to bust out anybody. But, uh, <laughs> um, over here, you figure you got, um, you know, the stateroom store give you ice for the water, etc. Another thing, a uh, big bottle of water. Like about three three dollars and ninety five cent. So make sure you you know you watch it before you even try to try to drink out the bottle. Make sure you actually pay attention to this. Okay. Now I I, I can understand why it's three ninety five because for one look at the bottle it's like humongous. But just make sure you look at the tag, people, please. Um. So there's that. Uh. Very nice. Over here you got the phone. I'm pretty. This is this should be self explanatory. Um, where you can call state room, etc. etc. Very, very well, hopefully self explanatory. I'm on there. Um, I figure you got the wall outlets over here. Now, I don't know what happened to, I think it took the, I think it's like the overseas outlets. I think they took it out of here. So it was regular outlets, USB ports, which I like that they put that in here. Um, I think the Vista, the last ship I went on basically did not have USB ports. I think, quote me if I'm wrong. I'm not saying it did not. I think it didn't, I think. It probably did, I'm not sure. Um, as you all know, I am platinum. Yes, Kevin Rose is, is the freaking camera, the freaking focus, Jesus. Oh, God, okay, all right, wait. Oh. As you all know, I am platinum, yes. So, yes, they are different colored cards. Uh, this gray looking card, silver card, that means you're platinum, all right? The red card, the red card, your first time cruiser. Um, I think it go to blue, then to, um, then to yellow, which is the uh, gold member. And honestly, it just depends on how long you've been on a cruise or how many cruises you've been on, rather, if I'm not mistaken. And then right here, you put in your card into this little insert. This is to cut on the lights. And I think that, I honestly think that's pretty innovative because for one, you don't have to, it, it helps you not lose your card. You don't want that. But, um, but yeah, um, yeah, this depends on how many cruises you go on, you know, just to have like certain type of entities or certain type of, of commodities or amenities or whatever the word is. Um, you know, it's different levels, platinum, gold, um, I think it's diamond, and then bronze, bronze, and then it's like a red and blue card too, I think. Well, I know it's the red card, blue card, I think, but, but yeah, I don't know, I, other than that, I'm terrible, I'm terrible at being in front of the camera, really bad, but, um, now, for my favorite part, the balcony, oh my god, the balcony, oh, Yes, sir. All you gotta do is just pull down right there, man. Pull. Pull over. Yes, yeah, sir.
is a different layout from the Vista. The previous bathrooms that were on the other carnival ships, this is different. Uh, it seemed like it's a little bit more spacious, I think, a little bit, but this is nice. This is really nice. Of course, it smells like a bathroom. It smells like poop, but um, but yeah, oh, okay, all right, no, okay, look at that. Look at that, no, all right. Okay, okay, all right. But yeah, this is it right here. Um, for anybody who, which I think is, I think these are, wait, what is this? Oh, yeah, that's right. These are the plugs. In case you need to plug something in, I'll plug something in right there from the top. And then going on down. Yeah, I think the bathroom is really, really nice. This is a nice bathroom. Now the Ford door got me tripping. Uh, all right, no, nah, okay. All right, no. Nah. All right, no. Nah. Tell me what they're doing that bed. All right, no, nah, I better sit it down. Sit it down. Yeah, man. But listen, man. Listen, listen, listen. Yo, it's, it's going, we, we, this crew about to go crazy. We, I'm about to go crazy on this crew, y'all. Like, three years, three. I don't know, I think this is either my 13th or my 14th cruise. <sighs> three years. Let's go, baby. Mm. See, so, I was trying to find I was just trying to find my, uh, trying to find my state room. And finally I have found it. Finally found it. And I had my shirt on, we all, um, me and my family had our shirts on. Um, my family owns a business called Southern Charm Travel Agency. Um, basically, um, I mean, it's self attendance travel agents. And yeah, shout out to them. Right here we have made, they had made an old shirt. Uh, March and East, my cousin made the shirts. So it's our travel agency. And um, I took mine off. They're still wearing it, but I took mine off because I was soaking with sweat because I was hot and I was just ready. I was so ready just to like this get in the freaking room. I, I ain't even listen. I was ready in the room, cut. Wait, seriously. But yeah, shout out to them, man. Like, Make sure y'all check my parents out for travel, you see, man. Real talk, like, real talk. But, um, yeah, oh. More compartments, uh, more room. This is a hair dryer for all the ladies out there who need it. Um, man, I don't, never mind. Um, that's the second, second, second drawer that's down there. Third drawer. Um, oh, security. Valet service. Oh, I never knew about that. But, um, yeah. Then, of course, a little thing. Well, think about it, folks. And then, on and off switch for the light. Now, the light, I think, is really, really nice. Um, they really, really outdid themselves with this, this setup, man. I, I really love it. I like it. I like it. I like it. But, um, yeah, that's... That's a room tour. That's that's the room tour, man. That's that's the room tour. Uh how it'd be lit, huh? Like, what a crazy son. I lost. I've lost weight. 
Um, basically, I will now weigh two, what's it is? Two, 202 pounds. And my starting weight was at, um, wait, hold on, I'm breaking this up. My starting weight was two, uh, 245 pounds. Now I weigh 202. I feel good, man. I feel good. I'm gonna keep on going, try to get even more fit. Although I know I'm probably going to gain like 10 pounds off the cruise because I'm going to be eating. I'm sorry, I know, I, I know I've been on my weight loss journey, but I know I've been on my weight loss journey, but I guess the freaking eat, bro. Like, I, I'm not, nah, man. Like, that weight loss stuff out, out of limits. I, I'm eating, I'm eating, bro. Fuck with, chillin' with the boys, you do 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 What? You tell me how you don't fuck with, 